They say they've got their man tonight in a series of muggings in Central Park in Midtown, and they say they caught him trying to rob a seventh victim. CBS 2's Tracy Carrasco has the story new tonight. 55-year-old Cecil Richardson walked out of the Midtown North Precinct in handcuffs, a stone-cold expression with no apologies to the string of victims he's accused of mugging. Is there anything you want to say? Are you sorry? NYPD officers caught Richardson trying to rob a man Friday morning when police say he aggressively approached the victim and demanded money from him in front of this Hollister store on busy Fifth Avenue in Midtown Manhattan. Richardson saw the officers, quickly walked away, and hopped in a cab. The officers caught up to the cab a few blocks away near Rockefeller Plaza and arrested him. Police plastered these wanted posters throughout the area. Richardson is accused of robbing six people dating back to April 10th, the most recent May 29th, all in Midtown Manhattan and Central Park, a place many believed had shed its reputation of crime. It's a pretty safe place compared to what it used to be maybe a long time ago. Once in a while you have an episode such as that, but more often than not, I feel pretty safe. Police say Richardson demanded cash from his victims and in some cases pretended to have a gun in his jacket. Even more alarming, the muggings happened during the day. Is that scary though that these crimes would happen during the day when there are a bunch of crowds? <laughs> Terrifying, yeah. I just didn't think that that actually happened. It's New York City. Things happen anywhere, anytime, any place. So you just have to be vigilant. Cecil Richardson has been charged with attempted robbery, unlawful imprisonment, and harassment in connection with these six muggings. Reporting from Central Park, Tracy Carrasco, CBS 2 News.